All right, everybody, welcome back to Long Oak Farms. Here with your host, not the most, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, we're going. I just love how this thing, to me, it sounds like a Mustang. Can y'all hear that? I don't know if y'all can actually hear that or not, but it sounds sweet. It really does. But anyway. We're in our tribine, and we've got two fields left, and then we have to send these babies back. So we we got one in this field, and we got one in that field over there. And then we got to get busy planting after that. So fire this baby up. We're going to hire some workers. Hopefully that everything will go right. All right. Oh, wrong way. There we go. T-1000. Sounds like a Terminator movie. Oh, wrong button. There we go. I wish we could uh, harvest the straw from the canola, but that mod ain't out for 19 yet. Oh, wait a minute. By the way, help our friends. Looks like Francesca. But anyway, I, I still ain't done the names. Sorry about that. I got Andy. Andy, let's say Mr. Yankee. Uh oh, that's a couple of spots that's withered. Not good. Not good at all. But anyway, folks, that's what we're going to be doing in this episode is cutting these two fields and getting some straw up off the ground. So I'm going to help with this little corner right here. Now, as you can see up ahead, we got the semi sitting down there waiting. Uh, back behind here, we have the grain cart and semi. Don't know who will be needing unloaded first, but it's there if we need it. Now, I don't know what you're doing there. We're just going to be higher just for a second. Whoa, 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 don't go in the crops. Don't go in the crops. Shake that booty. Shake, shake, shake it. Whoa! Oh my god. Y'all see that? Forgot to turn the machine on. I should have hired a worker anyway. Uh, yeah, I know I don't have access. I just want to cut this little triangle portion and, uh, be done. Uh -huh. Oh, Eden's coming back already. Yeah, that right there. You gotta get that little bit right there, then we'll be, uh, Ready to just let this in a rock and roll. We'll be able to go do our straw harvest. Still don't know. I'm talking about just letting it go loose. I'm putting it in the silo. I think that way would be better. And our grass, hay, whatever we make. Uh, think about just doing some grass and getting the silo bunker right there beside the total mixed rations thing fill it up and that way we'll have our sewage right there all right hire a worker um update on this we got a lot of the woods knocked out and they got it seeded for grass to grow back so that's update on that uh, we have 
on our meat here. We got 56 liters left and hop back in the truck and you see how much we got there and plus what's in our uh, storage building on the other side over there. Getting a lot of lag. Um, let's see here. I need to find a tractor that's close to the shop. Oh, by the way, you can see right there that we got the trees cut down. I don't know. A lot of lag right here. Probably because of the straw. Trying to find an empty tractor. Not a forklift. Aha! I knew I had one on it already. I don't know if Course Play is going to do this or not. So, we're going to try. Let's see. Field work. Yes. No, no. Wrong, wrong thing. Get back in this. Yeah. Course generation. Headland. It's going to be one. Let's see. That's field 41. Go in here. Oh, I passed it. 41. Headland pass is one crop noise. Uh, I guess that's all looks good. Generate course. Okay, that looks pretty good. Looks like maybe we're starting right here. Let's back out. Yeah, because it's kind of turns green right there the way it looks. Okay. Um, let's take the aisle. Go ahead and start her up. Oh, start points right there in front of us. Ha! Good. Let's see. I'll go ahead and let down. We're going to turn it on. Uh, first waypoint, drive course, stop the lines. Oh my god, we're almost out of fuel. Oh well, we'll pick up one load and then we'll go from there. I'm curious to see how this uh, course play is going to work on this. If I get pretty good at it, we can fix it where we have a a route where you can unload and just let them be. So I'm going to go ahead and close this. Hopefully we won't need it. There's a big old solar panel. Now what you doing? What you doing? Now he's probably going to miss that corner right there. Hop out and get run over. We're going to go over here. And I got a big, big issue here. Yeah. Get a lot of poop. Let's see here. And we should have quite a bit of slurry. Yep. Our pit is getting pretty full. All right, I need a uh, another tractor. Ah, no more tractors in here. Um, let's see here. What I'm trying to do is figure out. Oh yeah, I gotta go in here and complete that and that and we have two bailing and also a fertilized mission to do 
Uh, no loan. Let's go over here. Combines look like they're doing pretty good. Um, so far, we got cotton here and we got wheat here. Our wheat probably going to go into soybeans and our two canola fields are going to go into corn. We'll probably square this off to get to um, so I'm going to check and see what we need behind uh, those two fields. Um, looks like this needs fertilization. Do they need plow? No, they don't need plow. So no plow, no lime. So you know what? I think we can go straight into planting corn. Let's go to here. Um, we need to plant corn first. Because we only got, what, today and tomorrow, and then that's it. And we'll have uh, three days, three extra days plant soybeans. So we're going to get tractors fired up. We got to get them filled up, looks like. Um, can we actually do corn with these? Let's do that. Yep, right there. Set the corn. So, first thing though, we got to get some fertilizer. Let's jump in our uh, case spreader here. I think it's got lime in it. Oh, no, we have fertilizer. All right, we're going to go do that first then. Because since, oh yeah, this is lease. We got to hurry up and get this back too because we'll waste some money on it. But as I was saying earlier, we got the trees down here. We just uh, got the field pushed out some. Uh, actually need to plant a strip of cotton right through there. Um, of course it won't be fertilized or nothing. Alright. Alright folks, I'm going to get this over to the field and I will see y'all in a bit. All right, er, uh, guy didn't pick up too much on the ends here. That'll be all right. All right, get this thing unfolded. And get our GPS going here. Okay, and... Turn flashers off, beacons off. Now we're going to be running east and west. All the way. I don't see my mark. Aha, now I see it. And our combines are just about 30% full, so they might be able to hold all that. Right there. There goes the fertilizer. Okay, and we are fertilizing back behind our combines. Or at least in this field. 42 and 45 is going to be corn. Uh, 42 we don't have to do nothing with. But 45 we're going to kind of do the, the north end right there. And straighten it out some. Yeah, I'm just going to do some of this myself. Temporary.
until we uh, need to do something with the combines. I don't know how much is actually going to cover. Alright. Now I'm going to do it. Shot down through here. And we won't be going in our neighbor's field. Let's go over. Can't lift or fold the wings or anything. That's one thing I really hate about it. Yeah, right, lock back on. I think what I'm gonna do is bring that big cultivator we got over here and behind this, kind of smooth out and get rid of some of these bad spots where the crop didn't grow right with withered and uh, get them out of the way be smoother for the planters combines are rocking and are rolling I was hoping our straw buggy would be full by now. So we could get that taken care of and get him filled up. Tell you what, let's stop right here. And go see how he's doing. Oh, he's still running good, but it's kind of wasting. All right, we're going to stop driver. Uh, we're just going to scoot over. Sometimes you just got to do it yourself, folks. I'm going to finish this out to the end, go back and get what we just missed, uh, empty this out, fill it up, fuel, before we do run out, and uh, I will see y'all here in a bit, hopefully back on the combines. What? 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 Go over here and get this pile. I think it's the only pile he left. He's on the corner. There we go. All right, be back in a second. All right, just got through dumping the last of the straw. I'll put some in the TMR mixer and then uh, the rest in the silo. And now we're going to go back behind my house and finish getting that fill up. So I figured I'd just uh, come across this in here. Our combine's just about done. Yeah, I left a little smidge there, so not too bad. this up real quick so I can go through here. Uh, Betty has completed her task. Okay. Let's see. Let this back down. Unfold. And I gotta see. Uh, 
Alright, there's the start. So it goes like that, like that, like that. Okay, so. That would be right. It'd be going that way and going. Right? Yeah, should be. Should be. I got that done, so. Go ahead and get it started on this line. Go here, get this. And I don't think he's going to reach it anyway. Alright. I'm going to take that off. We're going to. Oh, don't. Nearest waypoint. We're going to drive course. Stop at the last. And. It's hard to find good help. Okay. Well, anyway, we gotta go to our, uh, our combine. Well, one of them's done, the other's not. So let's run over here real quick. Actually, can I do this? I don't want to take me to the I'm gonna let you do your thing. I don't know why you're doing it that way, but okay. And this dude looks like he's done. And this was, uh, oh, sorry, do that. But this is what I'm talking about, folks. We are going to have to, right here on this little tail, go down straight through there and just gather, you know, get it as straight as possible so we won't have no problems. And, uh, Hold up this header. Watch it be a spot down here. I need to. Well, yeah, you can see like right here it curves. I just want it to actually go straight as possible. As far as possible. Not too far because we're going to have a road going across here somewhere. Probably even with that driveway over to the right side of our silo up there. Alright. Pipe out. Where's my truck at? Okay. So it didn't need a grain wagon. So that's good. Oh, trees in the way. Trees in the way. Oh, brakes, brakes, brakes. I forgot about the brakes. Let's do this. And that field there, we're probably going to buy it. It's got barley in it, and the next field's got cotton. So I'm thinking about buying both of those fields. Um, but they're going to need some TLC. Like weeds pulled out of them. And Franz has completed her task. There, it looks a little bit better. Is it going to hold all of it? Alright. Cool. Alright, we're going to. I'm going to park this guy here and let the. Uh, the market shop come and get them. Really, dude. Really. Good help's hard to find, folks. I swear. Alright, let me, uh, this is getting kind of long. Let me, uh, go ahead and finish this real quick. And I will bring you back when we get everything said and done with the final count of, of uh, canola. And I'm sure you won't want to take it. Be right back. And just like that, we're done. Along with the 8400 has reached its waiting point, which should be the straw. And yeah, unload this and then uh, get y'all total. Oh, I guess it would fold the header if I put it on the right, right lever. Wow, right, this field's been harvesting. So drive over. Wobbly little thing. Combines are pretty good, but I just I, one positive thing is the hopper size. That holds a lot for being how big it is, but um, what? You didn't hold it all? 
3,800. Okay. <sighs> All right, folks. I'm going to get the truck bring down here. If it'll hold it. Be back in a second. All right. I got about five or six minutes left. I've been trying to get this world under, you know, around 30 minute mark. But I am making a boo boo. All right, we'll keep going this way. <laughs> oh, that's, that's about like Mr. Blue making boo boos. Let's see, we'll turn on our left turn signal. Is that even working? Yeah, it's blinking barely. We're not going to the meat market, folks. We're going to make our own fuel. Office canola, which we got uh, 73,910 liters, or that is 2,097.5 bushels of canola in this truck. A bad dip there. Um, it does take canola, don't it? Tip side back. <laughs> it, it would work if I got on the right side, too. Silly, Mr. Blue. Oh, there we go. I don't know how much it's going to hold, so. Hopefully the whole thing. In a way. Yeah, our number's not working. Just lovely. But this was on the mod hub. Oh, it's working on this side. Hey, we already got 10 gallons of diesel, or 10 liters. Not bad. Sound like it's going to take the whole thing. Oh, it takes time for them to show up. Okay. Now I forgot how slow this trailer's dumping. <laughs> I'd be back in another second. All right, we got 73.410. We got 50 gallons of diesel already. Took another look back on this side. This would be where we get it out at. So, yeah. Come back in a day or two, we should have a lot of fuel. We're going to need it, too. All right, I'm going to get this truck back. The other load is going to go into the pig food silo. So, I'll see you when I get back over there. Back in a minute. Second to go. All right, this one is 100% full, so that's 100,000 liters of canola. And our pigs probably going like, "Yay, food!" All right, I wish uh we had a way it go straight out from here. Take that fence down, but they just just don't know if there is a way. All right, we're gonna untarp. Oh, I had the trigger. Let's see, don't know how much it's gonna hold. What is that? That. Is sunflowers, canola, and soybeans. Potatoes and sugar beets. And this is your cereal crops like wheat, barley, and oats. Oh, we need some wheat over here, man. Well, we're going to have a field of barley coming soon because I'm, I'm going to buy that, I think. All right, the rest of this we're going to put in a silo over here. I think the tractor might be in a way. It might not be. Oh, I forgot I had another scratcher. I need to get that in that other field. But folks, this is going to pretty much wrap it up. I got uh, 
a little bit on the straw I was doing. I was waiting on the trucks to get from one place to the other. Alright, let's go ahead and check this out. Go over here and look. Going on up, canola. Uh, we got 1,295 sugar beets in here. and we, Oh, we got wheat in here. 12,000 liters of wheat. Cool. I need to go ahead and pull that out. Let's jump over here real quick and see how much pig food we got. Oh, we, we should be sitting pretty right now. 85,000 liters. Cool. And we have we're up to we are maxed out already wow okay we, we gotta sell some pigs I don't know if that'll be in the next episode or not but uh, we might save that for a rainy day um, yeah Gotta get all that stuff done, and uh, I will see y'all in the next episode, folks. This thing is still emptying out. Oh my goodness! All right, y'all. Thank y'all for watching. Thank you for supporting me, folks. I, I love each and every one of y'all, especially your comments and stuff. Uh, don't forget leave a comment. If you don't want to leave a comment, leave a like. If you don't want to leave a like. Leave a hit, a smash on that red button. It helps me out. Whatever you do, it helps me out. And uh, yeah, y'all have a great day, a blessed day. I'll see y'all later.